year, the Kentucky Derby Museum updates their winner circle exhibit to recount the story of the most recent winner. This year's updates are now finished and Wave News reporter Sean Bowdy shows us the pieces that are part of Mage's run for the roses. Trapped in the Kentucky Derby Museum basement for months, the replica horse depicting every Derby winner is finally emerging and now takes the form of mage, even down to the nasal strips. And it's the centerpiece for the Winter Circle exhibit. There's been a lot of interest already in just the few days that we've already had everything up and people taking pictures and being able to learn about all the different people that are involved with Mage. All right, let's go check those out. The Vanderwinkle family is visiting from Minneapolis. They're traveling to the Smoky Mountains. They like horse racing, so a stop here makes sense. The youngest, Casey, also wanted to gloat a little bit, picking Mage in the family pool. We had kind of done like a little family bet, and I just chose as a last choice because we went in circles. Dad Ryan loves sharing these experiences with his daughters, even if it's just sorting through the races Triple Crown Champions. 48, 77, 78, so three in the decade. And then 2018. Middle daughter Clara likes the fashion she's learning about. I think it's just really interesting because everyone, all the women do it, and it's just a... It's a little fancy, right? Connection, it's fun. yeah. The family enjoyed their trip to Louisville and hope to come back again next time, maybe for the Derby itself. Maybe we'll just put it on the bucket list and it'll happen sometime in the next 10 plus years. The Winter Circle exhibit now includes Mage's race day halter, a hat signed by Mage ownership and two of his race-worn shoes still full of dirt from the race. In Louisville, Sean Bowdy, Wave News.